today actually it started early this morning the um, 20 to 30 centimeters of snow all the cars and the pile of snow and that's why I'm going out to check on my car and see if it's still alive so as you know Montreal is one of the cities where parking is really terrible so the snow is starting to pile up I have to start my shoveling tonight <laughs> so I can use my car tomorrow let me show you how to make pala the snow <laughs> so it's oh my gosh okay so I need to like scrape this off first it's still soft so like I said really Anisha although it's a bit um, thick oh my gosh so this is like the situation on this side it's already piled up so I don't know maybe I'm just gonna reverse to get out okay you know it's like when you open the door to your car it's like you're not you're opening the door to the key <laughs> yeah it's so dark because the windshield is covered in snow so what I do first is I have to start my car um, there and then okay so it has to start warming up because it will also help melt the snow on the windshield so I can't really see very clearly so I'm gonna change I'm gonna switch the mode to um, I don't know I forgot what it's called but the air from outside something like that <laughs> Okay, and then I'm gonna open my trunk for my... I'm gonna open my trunk Oops. for my pala. So that's my shovel. So I actually have all the tools that I keep here. So they... I keep them here all year round. <laughs> to take my pala out and I make sure that the muffler is not covered. I mean it's not there's nothing that's blocking it. Wait. Okay let me see I need my brush and my I need my brush and my scraper. I don't even know where to start. So, okay. I'll we'll get up to that chair. And then I'm gonna start with here, this one. So, it's, it's kind of thick. Oh, dude. And you make sure that you always wear high boots, okay? Um, the snow turns to water, so you don't want your feet wet because you don't want to get sick, right? So, in this case, I use my scraper first because it's easier. You know, you see that? Amazing! <laughs> So I have to do the front part first and then after I'm gonna do the top and then I'm gonna start shoveling. Okay, so I've already finished the, the windshield area and the top. 
finally done shoveling. So the the technique is usually you just have to it's like you're you're making a path for the car. So you have to make sure that the area where the wheels will most likely touch should be clear. So that's why and here as well, I am so happy with my work because I totally cleared it. Yeah, it will be slippery. So, the rigid monitor is the car. And also, you see this big snowball. So, it will be really hard for your car to, um, to move. Okay, so I've been shoveling for almost half an hour and I'm just gonna sit here in my car for a little while oh goodness right. I'll reverse a little bit just to check if the path is clear enough because I don't want to shovel tomorrow again will you do this like I just turn the wheel to the right and to the left. Parang kahit po ng snow ba. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's, so it's moving. But you know what? It looks so magical. I mean, the first snowfall, it's really beautiful. And then when it gets uh, mushy, like a slush, and then it becomes really dirty, that's when it's not fun anymore. <laughs> okay, what it looks like there. <laughs> so, pag fresh pa, it's like this. So, it's still soft. So, it's, it's a lot easier. To shovel. The snow has been piling up for a few days already, which is which was the case before, so it was harder for me to shovel. So it took me like an hour. You see, they're all covered in snow, but you know, this is not even worse yet. I've seen worse. <laughs> Wow, this was like, this is like my exercise for the day. 